team of doctors and nurses from Tyneside are back at their day jobs after undertaking some extraordinary work in India. As a result, these patients can see again, but that wasn't all. The team transformed and in many cases saved the lives of more than 150 patients in one of the poorest parts of the world. And the doctors filmed their work at the Walla Walker Hospital in Durban exclusively for Look North. Here's our health reporter Sharon Barber. It's a long way from Tyneside. This part of India is one of the poorest places in the world and it was here that the team of doctors arrived from the northeast to treat often extremely ill patients. They arrived from miles around and queued all day for major surgery or to have their eyesight restored. The first year we arrived, well all of the patients had just arrived as they heard about the, the call at the UK camp and they literally camped out in the hospital grounds so we felt under enormous pressure to get through so many operations. This is the doctor's seventh trip to help at Walla Walker Hospital. In just one week the team of doctors and nurses from this hospital and others across the region performed 150 operations in India and they did the work for free. The team was led by this man, a consultant anaesthetist at South Tyneside District Hospital. They are very poor and, uh, and if somebody gets ill, uh, the access is so uh, sort of distant that uh, they find it very difficult to travel. We've had quite a few children who've had worm infestation, which is something that you literally don't see here. Um, and the, patients, the children have been quite ill and needed major surgery. So those sort of patients stand out for me that we know that we've um, saved lives. And by the time they left, 55 patients could see again. Each one a huge success for the Tyneside medics, who were already planning to go again next year. Thank you all very much. Thank you. Sharon Barber, BBC Look North. A fantastic effort. Now, let's